Hey guys, Julie here with WRWDW, and today I want to talk about my favorite character meals at Disney World. So let's be honest, there are a ton of character meals and there's no wrong choice when it comes to character meals at Disney World. So here are my top five character meals at the parks at Disney World. Number five on my list is Hollywood and Vine. This is a character meal at Hollywood Studios and I think my decision might have something to do with my little friend back there who is obsessed with Minnie Mouse and Doc McStuffins. Hmm. As you can guess, this is a Disney Junior character breakfast or a Minnie Mouse lunch or dinner. So this will definitely appeal to the little ones like my friend back here. Yeah. Disney, that's right. See, she knows. Number four on my list is the Crystal Palace. This is a classic restaurant located on Main Street, USA, one of the originals at the Magic Kingdom. You'll have an awesome buffet, you'll get a chance to meet Winnie the Pooh and all of his friends, and if you can time things right, you might just get a chance to see the parade out on Main Street while you're eating. Number three on my list is Cinderella's Royal Table. This is the restaurant that's located inside the castle at Magic Kingdom. So even though this is a pricier restaurant and it takes two credits if you have the Disney dining plan, it's still a must do if you've never done it before. You're inside the castle, you get to meet a whole bunch of princesses. So you walk in, you meet Cinderella first, you go up for your meal, which is a three course meal, and you get a whole bunch of other princesses, usually like Snow White, Jasmine, um, Ariel, you'll meet a whole bunch of princesses there. So it is a must do if you've never been to Magic Kingdom before. Number two on my list is the Tusker House. This is a great restaurant located in Animal Kingdom and they do a really cool character breakfast with the Fab Five. So you get to meet all the classic characters. It's a buffet, so there's a wide variety of food. And if you've got picky eaters, they've got the Mickey waffles and the real basic stuff. Or if you're more adventurous like me, they have some spicier, more fun and interesting options as well. So there's a great variety. You get to meet classic characters. And if you're lucky enough to be able to book a reservation before park opening, you can get on Kilimanjaro Safari with no wait, which is really awesome. So what is my number one favorite character meal in all of the parks? Garden Grill at Epcot. And I know this is often an overlooked character meal, but I think it is amazing. It's located in the Land Pavilion. It's right by Sorin, the ride Sorin. And it's fantastic. The restaurant rotates while you eat. It takes about an hour for it to rotate all the way around. So about the time that you eat your meal, you'll have gone all the way around. You can look down over the Living with the Land ride, which is super cool. The characters are Chip and Dale, and Mickey is there, and so is Pluto. And it's a ton of fun. Chip and Dale are two of my absolute favorite characters. They love to goof around with you and with your kids. It's a blast. The food is family style and it reminds me of like a Thanksgiving meal. It is my favorite character meal at any of the parks. So what's the bottom line? The bottom line is character meals at Disney World are awesome. I like some better than others, but they're all going to be great. There's no wrong choice when it comes to character meals. So here are my tips if you are interested in booking character meals on your vacation. First, I would double check and make sure that the character you want to see is going to be there all the time. Sometimes some of the restaurants will rotate the characters out. So if you have your heart set on one character, just do a quick double check to make sure. Second, I would also make sure that the meal that you're interested in is a character meal, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Some of them will only do breakfast. Uh, be Our Guest, which is uh, the character meal where Beast is there, he's only there at dinner time. So you're gonna wanna double check before you book. I would also say to make sure that you book your character meals 180 days out. The character meals often fill up very quickly, especially if you're trying to get a pre-park opening breakfast or something like that. So double check everything. Book 180 days out, and you're gonna have an awesome time meeting all of your favorite characters. I'll see you guys in the parks. <laughs> Hi.